The Biden border crisis is also fueling the violent crime crisis in America under the radical communist socialist Democrats. It's open season on law enforcement officers like never before and on law abiding Americans. And by the way, I know it's possibly not politically correct, but I really don't care about that. I don't care about that. We have to give in those cities that are being ravaged by crime and people being killed, many, many people sometimes in a week, worse than it was in Afghanistan. Remember, 18 months, we didn't lose any soldier. I told Abdul, don't ever, ever, ever kill any American soldier again, because if you do, it'll be held to pay like nobody's ever had to pay. And he understood that. He understood that. It was very nice. I had a very nice conversation with him, actually. He, uh, he was very respectful. He called me Your Excellency, Your Excellency. He said, but why, Your Excellency? Why? Why did you send me a picture of my house? <laughs> Which I did. Nice house, actually. Very nice house. But you know what? For 18 months, we, had, we didn't have one soldier killed. Not one. And yet, in our Democrat-run cities, you have many people killed every week, and you have people shot every week. Worse than Afghanistan by far. Hard to believe, right? But we are going to do something about it, and the Republicans are going to do something about it. And I was always torn.